Okay, good afternoon, Wildwood families. This is Mr. Edwards, and the first time I did this, I did it from my car, and that was the plan, but I uh, wanted to pass along a lot of information to you this afternoon, so I'm doing it from my office. So uh, thank you for spending a few minutes with me. It's real casual, real informal. Just want to give you as much information as I can prior to starting our 100% virtual instruction Monday. Uh, please, if you have not done so already, your teacher should have reached out to you with Dojo information and invite and also your class codes for Google Classroom. So please get involved on Dojo and go ahead and sign in to your child's Google Classroom so that Monday uh, you're ready to go. All right, so we, I'm gonna go through the School Dojo site and give you some information just in case you haven't been linked to it yet uh, so that we kind of all stay on the same page as we get ready to start Monday. Okay, so first we will have Chromebook distribution this Saturday, the 8th of August from 10 o'clock to 11.30 in the back of the school in the carpool area. Ms. Burtis uh, wants to come in on Saturday with a few people to give out Chromebooks and electronic devices to students. Um, and parents, let me explain a little bit about how this works. When a child registers, the first thing that has to happen is their registration packet has to be entered into our J Campus system. When we try to do that the same day, and sometimes it's within 24 hours, depending on how many students that we have to register. And right now, I believe we're up over 480 students, which is, which is really good considering everything that's going on right now. So once a child's information is put into J Campus, then that information goes into another system okay, that's passed along to Ms. Burtis. So that then the username and password is generated for each child. So if you register your child on Thursday and we can get that information in, it still might be Monday before a username and password is generated so that your child can receive a Chromebook. So if you get concerned because, well, I registered on Friday and I wanna come on Saturday and pick up my Chromebook, it may be that the information has not been received by the system that the district uses to issue Chromebooks so that we can get you a Chromebook. But we are working to get everyone a Chromebook as soon as possible, okay? So Saturday from 10 to 1130, we will have Chromebook distribution in the back. Again, we ask that you see our website at wildwoodebr.org for information on completing the consent form for Chromebooks prior to arriving to pick up your Chromebook. It just saves a lot of time if you've already filled out the consent form. Okay, Wildwood Elementary has been designated a hotspot, an EBR hotspot for internet. So uh, we have a hotspot device located in the school. So if you, if you absolutely need to get on the internet, you can pull up in our parking lot and access the Wildwood internet or the EBR internet from Wildwood's parking lot in the front. So there's information on Dojo and it'll be posted on our uh, website, wildwoodebr.org to show you how to log into the hotspot. And so um, you can have that availability if you absolutely need it. Okay, our ancillary classes, there's Google Classrooms are ready to go, so there's information on our Dojo site about what our ancillary schedule is gonna look like and how to, how to access those sites. And uh, those teachers will be reaching out as well. Um, so you'll get some information on our ancillary classes real soon. Also, families, if you will be in need of meals as we are entering the 100% virtual environment, there's information on the Dojo site and our website, wildwoodebr.org, uh, to register for meal pickup. Uh, for the first two weeks or so, it'll be meals that we prepare here and pack, and then we will transition to the box-ready meals. But it's a little bit different than when we gave out meals uh, over the summer and at the end of last year, you will have to pre-register for the meals and there's a scanning process that takes place. So to save you a lot of time, uh, it would be great if you are in need of meals that you register ahead of time and that scanning process will be implemented. So when you come, 
your the barcode will be scanned and then the meals will be loaded into your trunk uh, so we're trying to do contactless delivery as much as we can and then uh, you'll have access to the meals but that's explained on uh, our EBR website and also Dojo and the district itself has put out information on the various social media platforms about meal distribution and that will start Monday at 1030 and I believe it runs from 1030 to 12 uh, so you can pick up meals if you need them. And actually that time is from 1030 to 1230. Okay, I just want to, as we, as I kind of wrap up, I just want to remind everyone that Wildwood Elementary has been, uh, is named one of the finalists in Baton Rouge Parent Magazines as the favorite public elementary school. And I think in terms of public elementary schools, we are the lone EBR representative for favorite public elementary schools. So please uh, see our dojo link. And it again is on our wildwoodebr.org website. And please vote for Wildwood as the favorite public elementary school. Uh, it would mean a lot to our faculty and staff and our school community if you would go ahead and vote for us. I believe that's all I have um, for right now. Just trying to keep you as up to date as I can and things are moving so rapidly and we so appreciate your support and your understanding as we all try to navigate through this process. But we will be ready to go. Monday morning teaching classes and engaging your kids. If you have any questions, please contact your child's teacher via email or they should be have contacted you on the phone or you can call our school office 225-766-6002 or you can email me at dedwards1 at ebrschools.org and I will answer your questions as quickly and promptly as I can. So thank you for your attention real quick. And uh, again, I will continue to update you as information becomes available and we'll get through this process together. So thank you all very much. And remember at Wildwood Elementary, we are this year leading beyond our walls. Thank you and have a great day.